Are you tired of having cables all over the place? Don't have nothing to uh, hold all your products? Well, today we got the, the gear rack. What do we think about it? Welcome to today's to today's review. Today we got the gear rack, especially for us truckers. It's got an 18-inch bar that you can hold your tablet, uh, GPS, cell phone, a power rack, a coin holder. I mean, a jaw for another cell phone. They got all kinds of stuff that comes with you know that you can buy to go along with this. But what comes with this is a GPS holder and a cell phone holder. So, we're going to go ahead and open this box up and uh, see what it's like. I also bought the uh, the power rack. Basically, it just holds, you know, gives you a, uh, see if I can get to where you can see it. Backwards here, I'm going with my camera here. <laughs> but uh, it's got the thing right here, you know, a little USB port and all that. It's got... According to the box, it says it's a three-port outlet. It's got two USB ports and a regular uh, cigarette lighter port. So we'll find that out when we open that up as well. So there we go. Go ahead and open up this gear rack and see what's in here. This is made by Bracketron. And I've used a lot of their uh, different brackets for, you know, holding my cell phones and stuff like that. So inside the box we got it's nicely organized. Got your suction cup mount right here, along with this piece. That's kind of funky. The suction cups got like a little sticky residue to it. So maybe that's why they say you can stick it anywhere. So we're gonna find out. We're gonna try to stick it to the dash and see if it'll actually stick to the dash or not. Okay, we got some empty baggies here. Now, uh, what else we got here? This must be for routing your uh, your cables and stuff like that. Maybe might be for the bar. We'll find out. We got one of the pieces here that I guess holds the uh, GPS, or maybe even the cell phone holder. I guess this is supposed to be magnetic, so it helps. You know. Hold everything. Got your instruction manual. We'll hold on to that, but we know us guys, we don't ever use instructions, so we're just gonna piece it together and hope for the best, right? All your uh your different screw in pieces. I know we're gonna need them. <laughs> Got the other piece for the uh for the tablet mount or for the GPS mount, which I have the Ram McNally tablet as you guys already know. The other suction cup and more baggies now we're gonna have to find the uh the right one that we need to hold my gps which i want to say is probably not that one it's probably gonna be this one i don't know because i have the tablet so i don't know hopefully this thing has the uh the adapter for the tablet in it if not, I might have to create something. So we'll find out. And here's a bar. Oh, it's actually got a little bit of weight to it, believe it or not. And I believe that box is now empty. So this is obviously for running, you know, when you're when you're running your power lines to it. So you can run keep it, keep your cables through it, nice and clean look, and that's why I bought the uh, power rack. That way I don't have cords going all over the place to my different things. But you can bend this to form whatever shape you want to make for whatever you, you know, whatever you need it for. So we're going to go ahead and piece this together. This obviously goes on here, like so. Okay. 
get all my little pieces here. Suction cup's falling apart. <laughs> but I do, I do like the uh, the form of this. I mean, it, it does have, like I said, it does have some weight to it. So that's obviously a good thing, hopefully. But we're going to go ahead and put this together here. I'm going to form this one side just so you guys can see it go on together. And this, I want to say, is probably going to be these pieces here. Let's see here. Maybe not. It's going to be these ones. Because I like to lock with the, with the square. All right, so basically, I guess my battery's dying on my GoPro. So basically, that's what it'll look like. You know, you can use this part for the suction cup it down. The other side will look exactly like this, and then we'll have our pieces up here for uh, the cell phone and the GPS and all that. So I'm going to go ahead and finish putting this together. I'm going to clear off my dash, find out exactly where I want to put this thing at, and then we'll start recording again, see how it goes on and give this thing a review. Stay tuned. Okay. We got our thing together. Bad news is, is if you have the Rami Nelly tablet, there's no adapter to connect your Rami Nelly to this. So therefore, I will be taking this thing back because at that point, I'm not spending this much money for a cell phone holder. But we're gonna see if it sticks to the dash at least. I already took off the little clear, you know, paper. So we're gonna stick it here like so. Push it down. That one's up. Push it down. Lock it on. It's, it actually sticks. That would be good. That would be good. If you don't have the Rami Nelly tablet. So if you wanted to do that, obviously then you have your other piece here. You know, your cell phone holder piece. Go to unscrew the little piece here. Uh, probably should have undone this first. Slid it on there. Screwed it on. That way you can hold your cell phone. Like so. Okay? So, uh, with that being said, other than the part of not having the, the, uh, the mount, for the Ram McNally, let me go ahead and turn around here real quick. Okay, we're going to try to finish this video before this camera dies. Um, but other than, they need a piece like this is what they need. This is off the old mount that I have for the Ram McNally. This slides into your adapter piece like so. But they don't have any pieces for that. Unless somebody opened up the box and took it out and returned the box, I don't know. But... Without, with that being missing, okay, so say if you didn't have a Rand McNally tablet, um, my personal review of it, I like it. It's definitely handy. It does make it a lot easier for somebody to just walk up and pop the little clips and run off with all your devices, you know, with the mount. Or if the devices are on it, they can walk off with it easier. But, in a sense, it keeps everything organized. So that's a plus for me. That's definitely a plus. Easy to use. Definitely comes with, you know, for, what is it, the Garmin. Let's see. It comes with the pieces for your, for your, uh, for your Ram McNally's, your, your 7 inch and 5 inch, you know, 530, 520, 720, 730s. Um. Uh, what else is it? For Tom Tom. I thought I had the Garmin in here too, but I guess I'm not seeing it. Ram McNally, Ram McNally, Ram McNally. Oh, Garmin, okay. It does have the, the, uh, the Garmin as well. Um, but other than that, my review. For the money, 
You figure it costs seventy dollars. Thirty dollars for the for the power adapter, which I didn't even open because I'm not gonna I'm not gonna keep it now. So we're gonna go ahead and return it. So I figure I'm not even gonna open this box. But um, this box comes with you know a couple different USB cords plus your power supply and stuff like that. Nine foot cord to power everything with. But other than other than the Rand McNally tablet part, I'd have to say I give it a good nine out of ten because it is it's definitely useful keeps everything organized you can move it anywhere i mean hell you can't stick a normal suction cup to a dash not without having one of these you know smooth plates which is what i had on there <laughs> now i'm gonna have to re-glue it back down with with uh, 3m tape but uh for regular suction cups you gotta have that nice smooth glass type surface and with those they hold up so uh my review on that nine out of ten unfortunately i'll be able to i won't be able to use it kind of sucks but i guess i can go get my money back <laughs> but uh for the makers at bracketron if you guys come out with another model of these and uh you come out with the rang mcnally uh tablet adapter i will most likely be buying it now i could have went and bought the um the adapter for the tablet, you know, that holds the tablet, but then you got $70 in this, plus another $30 for the tablet holder, for a $100 cell phone holder and GPS holder, to me it's not worth that kind of money. But to hold, you know, my phone, my GPS, the power supply, and if I wanted to put a tablet there, that wouldn't be too bad. Wouldn't be bad at all. But just to hold my GPS and my phone, to me, it's not worth it. You may have other thoughts. Uh, like I said, all my reviews are just my opinion. I do give it a thumbs up, though, for the effort. Because it definitely... I can see where it would work great. Um, but that's going to conclude this uh, review. So I can put all this stuff back in the box. Uh, any questions, comments, concerns, leave them in the comments section below.